Detroit Nervous Bible Training. Today we're joined by Matt Mallory with Meet the Pressers and PSNet Public Safety and Education. And today we're going to be doing a test of the Taser. <laughs> taser versus Commander. Not really though. I'm just going to see what it feels like and then I'll testify to that. It's not really a verse thing. I don't think I'm going to be able to not be affected, but I will try. Taser, taser, taser. Ah! Okay, 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 okay. Oh. Right, it's almost done, it's almost done. You got it, it's almost oh, done. Woof. There you go. Ah. Good job. Ah. Good. Yeah, mementos will be your, your probes here. Oh. Good? How you feeling, boss? Yeah. Ah. That works good. <laughs> that works good. Are you oh. going to Disneyland now? Oh, ride like me. That's serious. Champ. Man. Woo. I think three seconds is long. So, this rolled lightning. It was incredible. Very, very painful, but you can tell that it's something that uh, constriction motion, uh, but at the same time, uh, it doesn't feel like you're dying, but it does feel like you cannot move and you are you are feeling paralysis. Could you hear anybody talking or any voices and stuff outside of that? Uh, yes, I could. Yeah, so totally neuromuscular incapacitation locks up your muscles. Yes. But you still can hear everything that's going around around you. Other people telling you, hey, you're almost there. It's almost over. Yeah, I could hear them. And I could also hear me asking for it to stop. <laughs> <laughs> so that's because you're, you're, you can feel the, uh, the pain, but you also can feel that your muscles are locked up. And so you're going to be able to communicate as well. I was still able to talk. Yeah, so. yeah it's, an, it's definitely an effective tool. Definitely. Tasers work very well. It's an intelligent option to increase survivability. For sure. 